don't have to do math homework because I'm a dog. <laughs> Can you pass me the duct tape? <laughs> Is that your math homework? Oh, let me do that for my wonderful brother. <laughs> what do you want? Usual, but I don't have an excuse, so that's why I did the bonus question, so you'll come up with one. Hmm. Oh, where is she? Get out! It's Susan! She's got... Yes! She's two bigger than a marching band horn section! Oh no! She got guilty! Run, Blake, Blake! Save yourself! You realize he'll be back and then I'm done helping you. And that's why we're working on an anti-Susan love lozenge that will break Eugene of his crush on her. So I can get my life back! Now, your mission, little brother, is to keep bling bling away so we can focus on development. What? I am not heartless. I can't keep a man who's clearly in love away from his dream girl. I'll do your math homework for a month. I got you back. Jonathan, I created an elixir that will cure sweet Susan's backside blastoids. She went to the bathroom, felt better, and went to the movies. She bit her tongue and can't talk. Bye. <laughs> Tell her I have a new tongue. She's in the shower. Well, how long will that take? Uh, a month. No. Susan Test, go on a date with me. Here she is. An experiment went totally wrong. Your true love. Ooh. Oh. Slug. Nice. And now to test the anti-Susan love lozenge on Lolo. Notice how Lolo holds me lovingly. But when I give her the anti-love lozenge, she will hate Susan. <laughs> ah, get her off me! Get her off me! The lozenge makes Lolo attack dogs. Do you have any duct tape? <laughs> okay, we need more testing. It's a regular slug, sir. Not Susan Test. That's it! I want research! I want studies! I want war plans! And I want to know why I can't get a date with Susan Test! After extensive research and simulated computer dating, we've determined the main reason you can't get a date with Susan. Well, what is it? Are my tips too extravagant? My sense too alluring? Does she think I'm bad? Uh, no. The number one thing blocking you from dating Susan Test is Johnny Test. <laughs> Hours of surveillance reveals that Johnny is constantly blocking you at the door, keeping you away from his sister and... And foiling my plot of love! But if you can eliminate Johnny Test, your chances of getting a date with Susan shoot up 3,000%. Oh, but I've always kind of liked Johnny. I see a lot of myself in him, you know? But he must be eliminated! <laughs> Duct tape rocks! <laughs> My doggy sixth sense says something bad is about to happen. What? That's ridiculous! <laughs> okay, I believe. Johnny Tess, you will no longer stop me from seeing my Susan. And don't freak out. The lasers are non-deadly stun lasers, so I can capture you easy and lock you away so you can't keep me from my Susan. My senses now tell me to run. <laughs> Better, but still not the sheer hatred we were looking for. Blingling is trying to waste me! A force field? Oh, please! I know I have a force field blasting rocket somewhere here. No. Ooh, how about this one? When will the lozenge be done so Bling Bling will hate you and not me? We're still missing one more important and rare ingredient. Then give Johnny some mutant powers or weapons to protect himself! Uh, we used all the genetic mutating reserves in the lozenge. Sorry. And Dad took all the blasters after we neutralized the car last week. 
Well, then what's this rare ingredient you need? The beet beet root of a Pima cactus located in the Arizona desert. And how do we get it? With ugly sneakers? They are ugly sonic rocket sneakers. <laughs> Gyroscopic sensors detect your movements and 16 micro rocket boosters increase your foot speed to 236 miles per hour. Are you telling me I have to run through the desert while a super genius tries to hunt me down? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> What the? No! Oh, you cannot escape my super genius, Johnny Taz! You can run at 200 miles an hour, Johnny, but you cannot hide from my heat sinking missiles! He fired a missile! I hate missiles! They hurt me! Then I guess we'll just make a little U-turn. <laughs> Split up! Whoa, you know, I didn't see that coming. Yeah, it's me. Listen, I need another copter. Oh, and some TNT. The secret ingredient is just five miles up the road! That's right. Keep running, Johnny. Running right into my trap! Now Johnny will have to stop, and we will capture him. Or better yet, he will fall to his doom. Hit the brakes! Yes, it worked! Ha ha ha! Beat, beat. Now, back to the lab to get Bling Bling to stop chasing you and start hating your sister. So nice to see you, Jonathan. I have a little surprise for you. <laughs> We've completed the road work, sir, and it leads right into the rock. And right into my fake tunnel. <laughs> okay, okay, now, everybody hide. What? No way! That defies the laws of physics! And so does that. Oh, come on! An anvil! Beep, beep. But now there's one small problem. How are we going to get Bling Bling to eat a lozenge? Because he wants to blast us! Johnny Ted! Come out of your hands up! Your feet shoes off! No harm will come to you! I'll just lock you in a cell with the TV forever so you can no longer stop me from pursuing my sweet Susan! Uh, where's the duct tape? I have defeated you, Johnny Test! <laughs> I win! <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, what the? A lozenge? I hate lozenges, but... Not as much as I hate Susan Test! 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 It was! I never want anything to do with her because I love Mary Test. Huh? Sorta. It sorta worked. <sighs> yeah, you might want to take these. After her, I'm in love. The lozenge will wear off in about thirty days, then he'll chase me again. <laughs> And that will give you time to focus on my math homework. <laughs> <laughs>